Thank Private you, Report. Hey, folks, Jackie the Joke Man Mortling, 8 p.m. tomorrow night at the Strand Theater in Seymour, Connecticut. The jokes say, Alexa, play Jackie Mortling. Follow Jackie on Twitter, too. Jokes every day and the very funny at 4.20 p.m. International Marijuana Time. And of course, you can follow him at Jackie Mortling. So here he is again. We love him on a Friday. The Jackie. great Jackie the Joke Man Mortling. Hello, fellas. How are you, buddy? I, I can't stand it. I'm, I'm just doing so good. I just did... Two pilots, and I'm reading an audition today, and uh, the, my documentary is almost done. I, I hope I don't die with all this money. I don't I know, know what to do. Yeah. I was on the streets of, uh, I was on Hollywood Boulevard playing Stump the Joke Man, and one after the other, these people are coming up, and they just remember you and how you're doing, and big hugs, and I'm knocking off the jokes. Twice in a row, two six year old kids blew me away. Stump me. I got to send them all my Is that really true? It's, it's... No kidding. Why were the soldiers all tired on April 1st? Something about Fool's Day. I don't know why. Yeah, of course. That's where I went. April Fool's Day. <laughs> they just got done with a 31-day march. <laughs> <laughs> a six-year-old that's kid. That's funny. Look it's at funny. That. Look and the at other that. one says, uh, why did the teacher tie her class's shoes in knots? Why did the teacher tie the kids' school sneakers in knots? She wanted to take him on a trip. No, oh, <laughs> I don't stand there with eighty-five people standing around. The little kids are like slapping each other five, and you know what? You know what? what a it, dick it, I am! Wow, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give these two jokes to Kevin Nealon for later on tonight. Those are good jokes. <laughs> <laughs> Write them down, folks. Write yeah. them down. Some rolling. I'm just. Uh, hey, listen. I saw on, nice. on TMZ they actually posted a, a picture of you, an old uh, you, a handsome guy. You still are. Wasn't the headline? He's not dead yet. The, or no, the, the headline was <laughs> "Member him." Member him. And it was a picture of Jackie. You know, there was actually about 40 people they named, and I was first, which is very right, nice. And right. I got, you know, Is it a series that Harvey's doing, and they just put... I have no idea what okay. it was. It was just like... So they didn't even remember contact him. you. They didn't even ask you, interview you, nothing. Yeah, any, anything. It, it's great. You know, you know, people look at TMZ, you know, it was right. great to have my picture. Of course. of course, the picture on the thing when it first comes up yeah. was me with Jessica Hahn. It looked like I'd been drunk for about three weeks. Oh, you were. But then, well, I had been, but the next picture was great, so... No. And the second, you know, the guy after you was I missed, just so you know, so... <laughs> <laughs> I didn't recognize him. <laughs> yes. I, I thought it was Mrs. Winston Churchill. <laughs> it, was, it, it wasn't Ann Richards. <laughs> you didn't really hate Imus, although like Stern did. I, but you I had nothing against Imus. I told right. you, I was never ever in the same room as him, right. ever ever. But you life. had to hate well, him because of Howard. It was part no, of the whole. He was. That was he had his gig, and we came in. We we're the new kids on the block. You right. know, a few years later, Open Anthony came, and Howard was as crappy to them as Imus has been to them. You know, once right. you're on the way, way on the top. All you got to do is throw rocks at the guy at the top, you know, so who cares, you know. And I, I, I wouldn't make enough money to give a crap. I didn't care. If, you know, if I had said $4 more, I would have been over there as quick as Al Rosenberg. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's right. Uh, I stole, took Al Rosenberg away from uh, Howard Stern. No, well, uh, I'm, Al Rosenberg was, was with Imus. And I mistreated him so bad and wouldn't do anything with him, so he went and started working with Howard. Oh, and all of a sudden, I saw way. how valuable Al Rosenberg was, and he took him back. He was right. like a yo-yo. Right. He went back and forth, uh -huh. I guess, yeah. Such a great guy. Hi, Al. Yeah. I'm sure he's listening, I'm because sure, I know yeah. he's not working. All the Rosenbergs <laughs> listen to us, because we've got a Rosenberg. He's a mayor, by the way, of a city out in New Jersey. That's right, and he is my third uh, uncle. Anyway, uh, here we are with Jackie the Joke Man Marley, a couple of big shows coming up now. We're we're very clock conscious these days in an effort to get ratings like you got with Howard Stern. So we okay. got, you got get to these five jokes oh, I love in to the pay next attention six minutes. to my clock. You know I, know. Hey. <laughs> I know. You got a big clock. Strand, so here we go. Strand is almost sold out tomorrow night, so get your tickets now. Do you have a couple left? What? How do people contact the Strand to go see you? you? Either go to treehousecomedy.com or there's a phone number on jokeland.com. Can I just say this good. before you, you start your jokes? You can say anything because it's your show. That's I'm right. sure Bernard would like you to shut the hell up, but it, go it, ahead. You're probably right. Oh, no. But I'm going to say something nice about you. I like so that. take that back now, F face. I am so sorry, my Hebrew you you friend. I've seen Jackie in concert many times. Now, we did the, the Bernie and Sid comedy night, this but I've seen it. him in action. Boca Raton, New York. I'm telling you, he's great. He's not good. He's great. He's a bundle of energy. The jokes are great. Plays along with the crowd. So if you can get to the Strand tomorrow night, well, you know what? Don't go see him because he's a dick. He just, he just yelled at me. So uh, you go, know, go, see I got Kevin, go to Caroline's night and see Kevin <laughs> Nealon instead. <laughs> I just had two, you know, this, this Alexa play Jackie Martling thing. I got so many, I sold out uh, two shows at Uncle Vinny's last week and it was packed. And it's nice to be packing them in because I'm at the, I was at a point for a while I'd show up and it'd be like, 
Boy, I hope there's somebody here. I hate to really? tell these jokes to myself. Well, not really, no. but now I'm selling out, and it's it so feels good again. That is so. It's the good Strand this weekend, right? Yeah, and it's uh, and it's a lot due to you guys, as much as you know. I hate to give you any kind of. Compliment. I know you do. I know that. Yes. Well, we'll All take right. it. Well, Thank let's you. get going. Here we go, Jackie. Give us a five five joke. Let's do it. So a guy and his kid walk into a luncheonette, and there's a woman sitting there having a cup of coffee. And they sit down, and the kid is flipping a quarter up and catching it. And he's flipping up a quarter, and he flips it, and he's looking up. Accidentally, the quarter goes in his mouth, <clears throat> and he swallows, and he starts choking. He's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's like, my kid's, cho- my kid's choking to death. My kid's choking to death. The woman takes a sip of her coffee and sets it down, gets up and calmly walks over and stands the kid up and pulls down his pants and pulls down his underpants, and grabs his, his package and squeezes as hard as she can. And he goes, eh! And the quarter comes flying out of his, out of his mouth. And his father's like, that's fantastic. Wow. Thank you. Save saved my son's life. Are you a doctor? She says, no, a, a divorce lawyer. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good one. I like what I hear. I like what I hear. Very good. Very good. Very, Very relatable. Yes. So a guy works at the CIA. He comes home one day and he calls his wife and his son into the kitchen. He says, check this out. This is a prototype of our lie detector robot. It can detect when somebody's lying. His wife says, really? Can you demonstrate? He says, sure. He says, son, what'd you do after school? He says, I, I did my homework. Pow! <laughs> the robot slaps the kid. He says, all right. All right, all right. I, I went to Eddie's and watched the movie. His father says, what'd you watch? He says, uh, Black Panther. Pow! The robot smacks the kid. The kid says, all right, all right. We, we watched some porn. His father says, porn? When I was your age, I didn't even know what porn was. Pow! The robot smacks the father. So the wife looks at him and says, he's your boy, all right. Pow! The robot smacks oh, 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 oh. Nicely done. Nicely done. That is a great joke. <laughs> that, that's all I got. Oh, that was brilliant. That's, that's a, a great. That's a great joke. Well, why don't you have me on the radio? We'll do it next. Okay, time. good plan. <laughs> Did you write that one? No, I don't write any of these. I but I, I find the greatest jokes oh, ever. I drive people crazy. Joke. So a guy's walking along with his three daughters. <laughs> The first daughter says, Daddy, how'd I get my name? He says, well, dear, right after you were born, you were lying in your mother's arms. And there were flowers on the side of the bed. And a breeze came. And one of the rose petals floated up and landed on your little head. So we decided to call you Rose. She says, thanks, Daddy. His second daughter says, Daddy, how'd I get my name? She says, well, a while after you were born, we were bringing you home from the hospital, and we were pushing you along in a carriage, and we went past the flower bed at the hospital, and a petal from a daisy flew up and landed on your little head. So we decided to call you Daisy. She said, thank you, Daddy. His third daughter goes, he says, shut up, Cinderblock. Oh, man. Yo, that's cold. That's, that's, that's funny, though. That's my favorite one. That's my favorite one. Shut up, Cinderblock. Show a whole huge, huge wedding. Huge wedding. The cops go in the bus and collect everybody at the wedding, and they bring them all into the courtroom. And the judge, what the hell happened? The best man gets up and says, I can't explain it, Your Honor. It's very simple. We're having a great wedding. Everybody drinking, having a terrific time. And I decided to dance with the bride. And I got up and I danced with the bride. And I danced with her again. You know, and I danced with her again. About the fifth dance in a row, that maniac over there, her new husband, the groom, leaped up, ran across the dance floor, and kicked her in the crotch as hard as he could. The judge says, whoa. That must have hurt. He says, you're not kidding, Your Honor. He almost broke three of my fingers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, these are all they, they only get better. I, oh, my God. One more. So a guy goes to the doctor. Strand Theater tomorrow night, Seymour, Connecticut. Isn't that right? Alexa, play Jackie Marling. I sneak in plugs. By I right. like what I hear. You do it very well. And I appreciate it. 516 wine 40 years. 40, I was like 40. Guy goes to see the doctor. He says, "Doc, oh, geez, you gotta help me, Doc. I, it's, I got a weird problem, you know. I got a permanent erection. 
I can't get rid. I got this erection, Doc. You know, at first it was great. You know, the ladies loved me. I could. I everybody. I, I was a hit. You know, every. I couldn't. I'm fighting off the broads, but now. Doc, it throbs, it hurts, it's painful. <laughs> and Doc says, well, let me see what I can do. And the guy pulls down his pants, underpants, and the thing is sticking out. It's huge. <laughs> you got a parallel bar sticking out there. And it's huge and, and throbbing. And the doctor looks at it. And, and the doctor takes two fingers and pow, smacks the guy's penis. And a little bug, bloop, leaps off of his penis and goes, Ugh, goes totally limp. The guy goes, oh, oh, that's great. Oh, Doc, oh, relief. Oh, Doc, what do I owe you? Yeah, you help me find that bug. You don't owe me nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it's on the house for Olympia. Oh, that was a great, a I great love you guys. fantastic I love you guys. Oh, please check out Jackie once again and see more Connecticut at the Strand tomorrow night. Uh, play Jackie Martling. Say that to Alexa. Get all the great jokes. Go to his Twitter account, at Jackie Martling, every day, 4.20 p.m., International Marijuana Time. He's got a great joke. That was an amazing performance. Thank you. Wish me luck. I'm on my way to audition as a pot grower on Mr. Robot. Is that Which true? is an incredibly uh, popular show, yeah. and uh, but, that, but, that, but, that, but that, that wouldn't be acting. That's not you. acting you at all. No, not acting at all. <laughs> yeah. And the star is the guy that just won the Oscar, so I'm oh. in good company, and I'll never have to do this stupid show again. There you, know? you go, Jackie the Joker. Thank, 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 thank you. Thank you. Win for all of us. We'll right back. Back. <laughs> We're coming right back. Bernie and Sid in the morning.